The Bank for International Settlements, BIS, says it has made another breakthrough in its central bank digital currency, CBDC, interoperability project, claiming that it has successfully tested the integration of wholesale CBDC settlement with commercial banks. The BIS has been working on what it calls Project Helvetia, part of a network of projects aimed at helping central banks roll out CBDC offerings, and allowing them to operate in a global financial network. The bank is also looking to help bolster cross-border payment progress, which has found itself lagging behind blockchain and crypto-related innovation. In a press release, the BIS said that it and the Central Swiss National Bank SMB, and SIX, a Swiss financial infrastructure service provider, had integrated a pilot wholesale CBDC into the existing back-office systems and processes of its five commercial bank partners, namely Citi, Credit Suisse, Ben Wakoud, the head of the BIS Innovation Hub, was quoted as stating, We have demonstrated that innovation can be harnessed to preserve the best elements of the current financial system, including settlement and central bank money, while also potentially unlocking new benefits. As digital ledger technology, DLT, goes mainstream, this will become more relevant than ever. According to the BIS, the project was an investigation on the settlement of tokenized assets in central bank money, and made use of DLT technology to focus on a range of operational, legal and policy. Emmer justified his stance, writing that in order to maintain the dollar's status as the world's reserve currency in a digital age, it is important that the United States lead with a posture that prioritizes innovation and does not aim to compete with the private sector. Emmer has previously hit O.